central to the idea of a democracy is that each person is given an equal voice in deciding the outcome of the election. This process is what we call suffrage, or the right to vote in the election and public questions submitted to the people. Now, who are allowed to vote under the 1987 Philippine Constitution? First, any Filipino citizen who is at least 18 years of age. Second, a resident of the Philippines for at least one year and in the place where he intends to vote for at least six months immediately preceding the election. Next, let's talk about the scope of suffrage. First, election. It is a process in which people vote to choose a person or group of people to hold an official position. Second, plebiscite. An election wherein the people decide to accept or reject certain changes in the constitution. Third, referendum. An election device in which a law can either be accepted or repealed based on the popular vote of the people. Fourth, initiative. It is a process whereby the people directly propose and enact laws. Last, recall. It is a method by which a public officer may be removed from office during his tenure or before the expiration of his term. Now let's answer the question, can illiterate and disabled vote? The answer is yes, they can. During election, the illiterate and disabled members of the society are assisted by the election officers. Moving on to our next question, can overseas Filipino workers vote? Yes, they can, through absentee voting, or the process by which qualified citizens of the Philippines abroad exercise their right to vote. Let's move on to our fan fact for this episode. Did you know that Filipino women were first allowed to vote in 1937? Before 1937, only Filipino men were allowed to vote in the country. It all changed when Commonwealth Act No. 34 was made. Women in the country finally exercise their right to suffrage. That's all for our episode. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel because more incredible videos are on the way. Also, if you have friends, share this video. Thank you for watching.